Alright All right, guys, it is Thursday morning, today is my pool day, I didn't get to, how do I say this, I didn't get to um, record yesterday in the gym, I recorded a little bit the day before, <clears throat> so today I'm trying to debate if I should work out at the um, aquatic center or if I should just work out at the, the regular gym again, but um, I do want to get some footage in for you guys. Today's going to be a pull day, so that means I'll be working on my biceps, I'll be working on my backs, my, my latissimus, dorsi, all that good stuff, <clears throat> my traps, my rear delts. Um, and then my six day or my, my split workouts will be done here. Uh, I'm going to be moving on to supersetting and triple and triceps and. Um, just trying to incorporate different workouts with each other and trying to get different dynamics of stuff, which is usually good for you know for what what some people are looking for. Some people are just trying to lose weight. Some people are trying to build muscle. My muscles, I feel like, have gotten used to the routine that I've been doing for the past. I want to say at least six weeks. I mean, <laughs> six months, six to eight months. Um, so I think it's time for a change. And I'm also still cutting. Um, now for me. I'm not going to make an excuse, guys. I love food. <laughs> I love to eat. And it's kind of hard for me to maintain my diet. But I'm doing a pretty good job. Um, I've cleaned up a whole lot of my meals. <sighs> eating more greener. Eating more of the fish and the pro uh, chicken. And uh, fish and chicken. Which, um, by the way, guys, has natural creatine in it. So if you guys are taking creatine, you guys can also increase the amount of um, fish or chicken that you guys eat. Just make sure... It the fat's low, the protein is going to go up, and of course the creatine is going to go up. Now, the more muscle mass a person has on them, yes, you're going to have to add more protein um, and all that fun jazz. But right now I'm taking two scoops, two scoops of my ghost protein, uh, whey protein every day. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to start my detoxing again. This video is coming up after the trip from Boston, um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie guys, I could not get to a gym in Boston, I couldn't, it was non-stop movement, non-stop, I mean, I was on the go, I am I was the driver, um, myself and my sister that graduated were, were the drivers because we know how to drive in the city, we know how to drive in that type of area. And when they, when somebody wanted to go somewhere, we had to be there and available for them. So, um, I'm not trying to make an excuse, guys. I should have still gone, but I wanted to spend time with family as well. Um, so I did that. Um, so there's no workout footage, even though I did say it was a push day in the previous one. But here we're gonna get the workout footage. You're gonna see the first four or first three, um, first three workouts from my chest workout. All right. And that's basically my my pectoral mid medius medius. It's uh, basically the big um, mid the medium part of your pecs. So regular bench press. <coughs> um, two hundred. I did a couple warm ups beforehand with uh, one forty five or one twenty one fifty five. I should say. I'm sorry. Okay. So <coughs> um, again, yesterday I worked out my pectoral medius in my upper pectorals and um, got my shoulders in there as well. <clears throat> now, I'm trying to up my bench, so what I'm doing is I'm working at 245 for sets of three right now, for six sets of three, which I did pretty well yesterday. So I'm gonna up it up to six sets of, or five sets of four. Once I can get five sets of four with no struggle and no help, I'm going to move that up to six sets of four. And then slowly moving up, moving up to the point where I can get to the next level. Now I can do my max for um, bench was one. I mean two. What was it? Because two twenty five is what I do now for three two twenty five two forty five. So my max for bench is two um, fifty five. Um, because. I mean, that was one thing I experimented one day, and I just wanted to see how far I was at. But, um, <clears throat> that was a good max day. Then, on top of that, I PR'd last week before Boston. I PR'd 
with my squat um, at 315. Um, three sets of one for 315, which everybody was telling me I probably could have upped it about five to 10 more pounds and had a better PR. But I, I didn't want to risk it. I didn't want to try and, you know, make something into something bad. It's, I've, I've never hit 315 guys. I've never hit anything like that in my <clears throat> in my life. Um, so it was a happy moment for me. So my next goal now is to add another plate on there. So 405, here I come. And um, 315 on bench, here I come. And uh, I mean, I'm, I want to do this. And it's so much fun to realize what your goals are and everything like that. Um... Oh yeah, again, like I was saying earlier, I don't know if I'll, I'm probably going to go to the Aquaplex because um, I can film over there and people won't have a problem um, about it. So, I, that's all I got for you. <laughs> Another thing yesterday I did new and incorporated was, I'm going to do this every other day now, was abs. I think it's time for me to start incorporating more abs into my, my workout. I mean, it, your abs work every single day, okay? Every single time because they, they're the stabilizers of your balancing and everything like that. When you move forward, when you go side to side, when you go back, they stabilize your body. Now, when it comes to working out, you have to make sure that you arch your back, not too much, but to a, sm a small point. And also, at the same time, you're going to suck in your belly button. You're going to suck it in. So when those two come together, you're in that you're in perfect form for your for your core and and your lower back to be working as one. Okay, which is why they say also if you have lower back issues, your core is in the work. So I do have lower back issues, but I do a lot of deadlifts now, and I do a lot of squatting now and on heavier weights. So um, I don't just blame my abdomen area, but I want to do my abdomen area because I feel like I'm at that point where I can do it and. You know, seeing the results of what's going on, I need to get this done. Now, macros. I haven't really come up with a set plan of macros for you guys for myself. <laughs> Which I should do because in my NASM book, I've read numerous things of what you can do to, you know, manipulate your macros. Now, as a personal trainer, I cannot give anybody, you know, a nutritional ba uh, nutritional um, prescription, basically. What I can do is give you advice on what to eat, like greens, which is the best thing for complex carbs. Okay, so that's enough of this talking, guys. I'm pretty sure a lot of you are bored right now. So let's get into these workouts. First workout, bench press. Second workout, um, incline bench. Third workout, shoulder press. Fourth workout is the back workout. Hopefully I can get somebody to film me today. If not, then you're gonna see boring shit, but if I can, you guys will get a nice little edit, all right? Okay, really quick, guys. Just in case anybody's wondering, this is my stack, okay, so I only take pre-workout, Ghost Legend. This was the limited edition from um, the C, uh, the Christian Guzman Signature Edition. Edition, blah, blah. lemon lime flavor, pretty good. Now, the other one that I usually take is still Ghost, but it's the, um, the Sour Watermelon, which is really good. Sour, or the Warheads. Ooh, I love that thing. I need to order some more. My protein stack, of course, will be, I have both the milk chocolate and I have both the cereal milk um, ghost whey protein all right <clears throat> now I do have another one um, that I've opened yet and I'm not gonna recommend anybody take it until I've tried it but um, the company that helped supply that was division supply thank you guys for the cup <clears throat> division division supply Luna. gave me a shirt pre-workout and the cup Pre-workout, haven't tried it yet, so I wouldn't suggest suggest trying it. But uh, if you guys are into their apparel, I'll put the link in my uh, in the bottom with my discount code. Um, but yeah, all right. But yeah, take <laughs> one scoop of the ghost. I don't take well one and a half scoop probably with that big old lump on top. But um, yeah, guys. So we're about to head out now. All right. So <laughs> sorry about this.
All right, guys. Had a kick-ass workout. Had a kick-ass workout. Ah, oh, shit, dropped my glasses. Back pull, pull day. Now, I'm gonna get some errands done for today. <clears throat> Footage will be up on YouTube at least by Sunday. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So, um, yeah, signing off. Peace out, guys. This ain't over.